We've been lied to about coffee. Coffee does not stunt your growth. So in the 1950s, Postum had a coffee flavor alternative beverage. And to market it, what they did was they tried to say that coffee was stunting your children's growth. It was taking the rosiness from their cheeks. It was making them hideous. It was ruining their lives. But in fact, coffee is completely safe for young people to, to consume within reason. The same way you shouldn't be drinking 10 cups of coffee a day, you definitely shouldn't be giving 10 cups of coffee a day to uh, you know, a young teen or, uh, or an adolescent. However, coffee, if they wanna have one cup here or there, completely safe, not gonna stunt their growth, not gonna take the rosiness from their cheeks. It's just funny, it was actually like a marketing ploy from Postum to sell this, this other beverage, this kind of instant beverage that they had. So, I'm not saying go out there and buy coffee and sell it to your kids. I'm not saying that. That wasn't the point of this. The point was, it's just funny how some of these belief systems get ingrained into our culture, into our psyche, and really it was just a marketing campaign, which leads me to my final statement, which is marketers ruin everything. And uh, yeah, anyways, I hope you like this piece of, uh, this piece of marketing.